Hi, my name is Dave Andrews. Today I'm going to talk to you about the parts of a circuit board. Let's go to our computer where I have a couple of pictures to show you. The first one here is a what's called a printed circuit board or a PCB. Now you're going to find a printed circuit board in pretty much every electronic device that you ever use. Uh, if you drive in any modern vehicle, uh, there's actually a computer chip that is a printed circuit board that controls the various parts of that vehicle. Now a printed circuit board uh, relies on some kind of uh, solid medium. Uh, it's usually going to be uh, sort of a silicon type of thing, which is why they call it a silicon chip. That is a hard uh, board type of thing. And uh, inside of this board are going to be printed uh, basically metallic connections. Uh, you know, they're not really wires per se, but they are basically uh, printed uh, conductive materials that transmit electricity from one spot to another. Like as you can see here, there's a, there's a connection here. It runs along uh, this printed, uh, printed little uh, uh, conductor right here to get to whatever endpoint that it's going to. That's how a circuit board transmits electricity. As you'll notice, none of these touch, so you don't have any kind of uh, short circuiting or anything like that. And it, it is these printed uh, connections on the board that will transmit electricity from one point to another. This is a very common circuit board that you'll use. This is actually called a motherboard, and you see it in uh, pretty much every computer that you ever use. Now it's very complex. As you can see, there's so many connections here, they almost look white uh, when you're looking at them. But everything ties into this processor device here that's under this fan. Uh, now a motherboard has a processor on it that controls all of the actions uh, on that motherboard, which is why you see the most activity on this board around uh, the processor. Now there are multiple chips on this board right here. And all these connections go between chips, which are themselves just smaller circuit boards that are attached to the main circuit board, and they connect these chips together. So a chip is another major part of a circuit board, uh, and the connections between those chips are the printed part of it. So that's basically just a quick overview of the components of a circuit board. My name is Dave Andrews, and I've just talked to you a little bit about the components of a circuit board.